Update 2 on Typhoon Maysak, which is continuing to intensify now with winds of 110 miles per hour and a pressure of 952 millibars. Position is around 9 degrees north at 144.8 degrees east, which puts the storm uh, still over the Micronesian Islands. That's as of 2 p.m. UTC on March the 30th. The storm's expected to move towards the west northwest and uh, intensify further, reaching a peak as a category 4 storm. That's what we're anticipating in the next 48 hours. And then a gradual weakening as it approaches the Philippines. Um, we could still see typhoon conditions in the eastern part of the Philippines and towards the north as well. Uh, so I would be watching out for that one as well in the next few days, uh, particularly if you're living in the northern half half of the Philippine Islands. Um, but in the meantime, more immediate warnings are in effect, in particular places in Yap State. A typhoon warning in effect for some other areas of Micronesia as well, but Yap itself under a typhoon watch and a tropical storm warning, and that will probably be upgraded to a typhoon warning if the storm continues uh, on its current trajectory at its current intensity. A tropical storm warning also in effect for Woliai as well towards the south. Um, Places further east of that, no warnings in effect anymore. Places like Satawal, definitely Chuk, uh, long gone from that region now. Sea surface temperatures fairly warm at this point, around 28 degrees Celsius. Going to be gradually cooling over the next few days, which may um, be one of the reasons why it's going to begin to weaken uh, in around two or three days' time. I don't think wind shear is too favourable towards the Philippines as well in the north. Yeah, you can see it there on that map. Now, the whole red area towards the northern half of the Philippines shows very high amounts of wind shear until it gets towards there though until it clears Yap and Palau wind shear is remaining um, good uh, conducive and uh, the storm is likely to intensify until it passes Yap at the very least uh, dry air a little bit towards the left hand side of the storm as well latest satellite imagery shows how the eye has been emerging in the last few frames becoming clearer as well um, the southeastern side of the eye wall seems to be the weakest uh, and conversely the northeastern side appears to be the strongest at this point I imagine that it will uh, balance itself out and continue to become more well defined across the board in the next few frames um, as the storm continues to move towards Yap. You can just about see the island of Yap on the left hand side of the screen there, the little pink dot almost, um, and some spiral bands beginning to approach those islands uh, now. On March the 30th at 2 p.m. UTC, 90p is still going in the South Pacific. We also have Invest 91S and 92S in that little blind spot there. Uh, we also have, of course, the Typhoon and also uh, 99W, which formed in the Western Pacific near the International Dateline as well. As of today, 2015, uh, we've seen 20 tropical storms form so far. Uh, Maysak is the 11th uh, the category 1 hurricane equivalent storm with winds of 74 miles per hour or higher and is on the verge of becoming the 7th category 3 storm as well on the Sapphire Simpson hurricane wind scale uh, but unlikely that it will be a category 5 but you never know it is the West Pacific after all you can visit Force 13 on any of our outlets the website force13.com is the main place to be for all the goings on around the world storm wise of course uh, we're on YouTube obviously you're probably watching it there um, you, where you can see past and present videos as well on our channel channel and same too for the social platforms for the latest information search force 13 all in text on facebook and twitter at force 13 on twitter you can also speak to me on skype at fool 13 that time in numerals uh, to speak to me personally we're also live on air this evening at 9 p.m utc um, so look out for the link on the social pages and on the website as well we'll be broadcasting live on youtube that's all for now though